All right, guys, um, in this video, we're going to go over sling and swath with two triangle bandages. Diane's going to be our patient, um, Marshall's going to be a bystander, and Kimberly's going to be our EMT. Um, so the sling and swath is going to be utilized for injuries that um, have affected the shoulder, the arm, an elbow, a wrist, the hand. And so the sling provides some type of support um, so the patient can rest, easily rest, um, their arm in that sling. Before um, we begin, we want to assess PMS. So Kimberly's going to assess for for a pulse. Pulses are good. Good. How do we check for motor? Okay, she can squeeze. Equal. And then, can you feel this? Can you feel that? Mm -hmm. PMS awesome. is good. PMS is good. So we're going to need two triangle bandages. What kind of triangles are these? Fun fact. Isosceles. Triangles. These are called isosceles triangles. And what makes them isosceles triangles? This side is equal. So Diane, if you want, just kind of hold the other side up. And so an isosceles triangle has two equal sides, so the left and the right are equal. And we want to tie a knot at the top. Okay, and so go ahead and tie that knot right now. Okay, great. And apply the knot to the affected arm. So Diane's left arm has been injured. We're going to go under the elbow. And then the part that is in Kimberly's left hand is going to go over the opposite shoulder. And then the part that's hang hanging down is going to go over the affected shoulder. Kimberly's going to go behind the patient. And she's going to tie a knot. And then she's going to take a piece of gauze and then apply it between the patient's neck and the knot um, to prevent any type of chafing. Okay, and then we're going to take our second triangle bandage. How's that feel, Diane? Okay. Feel okay? We're going to wrap um, the uh, second triangle bandage as a swath, and it pretty much just maintains the affected arm closer to the core. It just keeps it secure to the core. And we want to have the swath go under the unaffected arm, the right arm in this case. We're just going to tie another knot behind Diane. And then what do we do after? All right, and then I'm going to check for a pulse in both. Okay, pulses are good. Can you squeeze this? All right, and then can you feel these? Yes. All right, thank you, Kimberly and Diane.